And here at home, 13 Action News reporter David Schumann spoke to a living link to that infamous day. A 92-year-old Las Vegas woman who was there remembers every detail, including a stomach-churning three days when she didn't know if her loved one survived the attack. And it always comes back to me. 75 years since Pearl Harbor. Feels like yesterday for Wanda Abarta. It was frightening because we didn't know really what was going on. We turned the radio on and uh, they were s telling everybody, stay in your house, don't go out. December 7th, 1941, a date which will live in infamy. Her father was working a construction job that Sunday just outside Pearl Harbor and about 25 miles from Wanda and their family home. We didn't know if he was dead or alive. It was three days of not knowing what was going on, really, until my dad came in, and he looked so worn out, and he said, you wouldn't believe Pearl Harbor. It's such a mess and so sad. There was another important man in Wanda's life on the island. Here is Dick Weaver, and here I am at 17. Her boyfriend, Dick, didn't survive. It, it was an absolute shock. Each passing anniversary doesn't get easier for Wanda. And you can't help but have the tears come, even after all these years. But she wears her American flag sweater and remembers. It's just so vivid. I can see it. I mentioned Dick Weaver, Wanda's boyfriend, who died that day. Many years later, Wanda had her only child and named him Richard as a tribute. She still keeps in touch with Dick's family. David Schumann, 13 Action News.